In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use a controller on Castle Crashers on PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to easily set up any kind of controller that you have for Castle Crashers on PC. This is even going to work if you have a PlayStation controller. For this video, I'm using a generic Xbox 360 controller, but like I said, any controller will do. So I'm just gonna get inside of the game, but I'm I think you can tell that I am able to use a controller, so all of the icons, all of the menus, everything will be adjusted with the controller, keybinds and buttons. You can even hear me pressing the buttons, the d-pad and the joystick on my controller. Regardless, for this method, you will have to run the game through Steam, so keep that in mind. This is only going to work if you run Castle Crashers through Steam. So I'm just going to show off this little start area here, but everything should be working by default. The only necessary thing for us to do this is to go over to Steam, so open the Steam Launcher, find Castle Crashers, and then right-click the game. Go over to Properties, and then Controller. Under the Controller category is where you will be able to find the option to set up any sort of controller to be used with Castle Crashers. Like I mentioned, this is going to work for any of these controller layouts, including generic ones. All that you have to do is enable Steam Input. As soon as you enable Steam Input, just restart Castle Crashers and you should be good to go. However, if you wish to spend a little bit of additional time setting this up, just go over to the Controller Configurator. In here, you will be able to browse through layouts made for the game, so you have official templates made by the developers, which is the intended way of playing Castle Crashers, and then you have community layouts, maybe from someone who has already played a lot of Castle Crashers and they believe that this is the most optimal one to use. Just make sure that you either have the official layout selected which should be the default or you select the community one you can also manually change the layout so you can go over to this option to change the joystick triggers d-pad and buttons but this is all you have to do now castle crashes will be fully playable using your controller on pc I hope I was able to help you on how to play Castle Crashers with controller on PC. If this video helped you please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.